Yeah, road crews have been hard at work. We've seen uh, ODOT crews coming along Interstate 71 here this morning. I've seen crews here in Cincinnati. And we know that crews are dedicated in northern Kentucky, all over the three northern Kentucky counties and beyond, and also at the cut in the hill. What I want to show you right now is Interstate 71 downtown. We've been seeing traffic really slowing down here right now, just past the Reading Road Eden Park Drive uh, exit sign there. I'm not sure what's going on up that way, but drivers have really started to slow down. I mean, we're seeing brake lights light up all up and down northbound 71 here. I don't know exactly what's going on there right now, but what I can tell you is this is a sign that drivers are seeing. The roads out there are a bit slick, uh, and also we're seeing accumulation, some type of slush, something of that nature uh, building up on the interstate. So that's just even more reason to take it slow as you're heading out there wherever you need to go. Uh, remember, road crews are out there working as well, so we need to leave them plenty of space uh, as they're plowing, salting, trying to keep up with the snowfall that's coming down here. Uh, another perspective here some of the side streets that we're looking at in Cincinnati and northern Kentucky, also Indiana. The side streets here, very much so snow covered. Uh, you know, I've been kicking around snow here, picking it up as we go through the morning, but this is a pretty good amount of snow that we're seeing here uh, that's building up on the side streets. And it's not uh, clear, you know, what the streets are going to look like where you live, but you can pretty much expect uh, that you're going to walk out to some snow covered roads. So be prepared for that. As we've been saying, leave early, leave plenty of space. Don't drive too quickly. For now, we are live downtown with the latest check of your conditions. Dan Griffin, WLWT News 5. All right, Dan, good advice. Thank you. We want to get another first hand look for you at the roads. Let's get right to WLWT News 5's Andrew Setters leading the way all morning at Live Drive 5. Andrew, what are you seeing right now? Well, Mark, we are seeing more slush and more snow on the roads. We are on Union Center Boulevard in uh, Butler County this morning, and we're beginning to see people slip and slide a little bit, too. We saw somebody trying to. Uh, make a turn on just a slight grade at a traffic light and their wheels were spinning because they just could not get the traction they need because of the amount of snow on the ground. We've reached that point of the morning where the road conditions, I don't expect them to get any better. I only expect them to deteriorate because with so many people on the roads, that means the road crews are going to have a much slower time of it trying to make their way around and throw some salt maybe plow and do what they can to get the roads cleaned up. So we've hit that kind of critical point in the morning where as the snow continues to fall, the roads are not going to get any better until we kind of get over this hump of the morning rush and people get off the roads again so that the road crews can kind of get out and do their work. Take it slow. Side streets, even main streets are going to be snowy and slush covered interstates, maybe in a little better shape. But uh, they're definitely going to be slow this morning. Reporting live, Andrew Setters, WLWT News 5.